This tutorial will explain how to use msconfig or the Microsoft Windows System Configuration Utility to disable some of the unnecessary programs that automatically load on startup. Disabling these programs will help your computer boot faster. msconfig can also be a useful tool for troubleshooting. You can see icons for a lot of your startup programs down here in the system tray, but a lot of them are hidden. To access the configuration utility, click Start, go to Run, and type in msconfig. Click OK or hit Enter. This will open up the system configuration utility. Click the Startup tab on the far right. Here you'll see a list of all the programs that load at boot. Some startup items are absolutely necessary. Others are simply a waste of RAM. In Windows XP, all Windows Essential services are loaded through something called Windows Services. This means that most of the startup items you see in XP are completely optional and can be turned off. If you were using msconfig for troubleshooting, you could click Disable All. Then you could re-enable one by one until you found the application that was causing the problem. So what you want to do is go through the list of items and turn off the ones that you aren't using. It's always better to turn off the item from the preferences of the application itself. For instance, a lot of the instant messengers always load at boot. If you go down to preferences in Yahoo Messenger here, you'll see there's an option you can uncheck automatically start Yahoo Messenger when I start my computer and it's better to do it that way but a lot of programs don't give you that option and that's where msconfig comes in handy there's a lot of things here for instance that I don't need WinZip quick pick Google updater DVD check and so forth and here you see Yahoo Messenger. Once you've unchecked all the things you think you don't need, click Apply and then click P Close. You'll see a message that you have to restart your computer before all the changes that you've made can take effect. Click Restart. Once you've restarted, you'll see a message that you've used the configuration utility to make changes in the way Windows starts. If you're happy with the way things are booting up, check the little box that says don't show this message or launch the system configuration utility when Windows starts, then click OK. That's it. Your computer should be booting a lot faster now.